family. Um, our family's been here for 110 years. This area's been in and out of crop rotation. It goes through a cropping phase, then through pasture phases, and that's happened numerous times. Given we're on the back end of a five-year drought, it's a pretty good state of affairs. Here we've got uh, very nice curly windmill grass butts. These are, this is the end of a pogan. Uh, this little fella here is a, a, um, a windmill grass. He's a chlorus truncata. Over here we've got just a, a couple of small examples of stiper grasses. Uh, on the ground we've got we've got good naturalised medics. They're they're all burr medics, but they're they're very good for soil health. This paddock uh, is next door to the grass paddock. Um, this came out of cropping last year. Although it was a very dry year, we undersowed loosen, which is common practice uh, to help our our pasture phase get going at the moment. And despite the dry conditions, we've actually got got very good stands of loosen. Still see the stubble on the country, so it's still protected from uh, the wind. This paddock is uh, is towards the back of our place. Normal rainfall is about 17 or 18 inches. We've we've had six inches of rain this year, and uh, this is you know when this ground's looked after. So you can see, I've, it's not a fantastic barley crop, but it's not too bad. Uh, the paddock we're in here is right alongside the cropping paddock. Uh, which we were in a moment ago. Uh, this is the same dirt. Uh, it gets the same rainfall. You know, it, I'm standing 40 metres from where I was standing a little while ago, or 50 metres. Uh, I've got no ground cover here, no, none to speak of really at all. I've got pine thickets behind me. I've got these wilga trees. We got eucalypt seedlings and, and and way too many eucalypt trees. You know, it's really quite unproductive country. What what needs to happen in this paddock is for most of these trees to be gone and the and the soil health uh, put at the top of the priority list to start with. Uh, obviously, we don't take all the trees out because a few trees are clearly a good thing. But um, the soil health in here compared to the grass country that we've looked at and the stuff that's just coming out of the cropping phase, this is, to be honest, this is in a disgraceful state. The cropping in, in a lot of areas, and indeed in some of my paddocks, is used for nothing more than a tool to, to keep the country in good order. And, uh, you know, everything we do in our places is reliant on having good, healthy soil.